Okay. It's time to celebrate. It's time to celebrate. It's time to celebrate. Yes. It's time to celebrate. Yes. Y'all know why? Y'all you know, know why it's time to celebrate? Because I got 100,000 views. Yes. I love you guys. 100,000 views. It is time to celebrate. Today was my glorious, most glorious day ever. I feel like a wonderful person. YouTube card to subscribe. I feel like the most wonderful person in the world. I'm going to eat chips and beer for dinner. That's right. I lost weight. I got 100,000, 100,000 views. I don't know. If, I don't know if most of y'all even know what that feels like. But I'm telling you, I'm way up here right now. I am way up here, way up here, way up here. I don't think nobody. Everybody got quiet at work. They got quiet. They're like, really? One hundred thousand? Yes, one hundred thousand bills. One hundred thousand. Yeah. Not ten thousand. One hundred thousand. One hundred thousand views. And four hundred and seven subscribers. Last time I looked. Well, last time I looked. 407 subscribers, 1,088 views. It jumped that quick. Yeah. In 88. This morning, it was 44. 1,044. Now it's 88. Well, last time I looked, it was 88. I haven't looked yet. Let me just say this, Renee. Every time I step foot in this ring, I take pride in what I do. But I am human. I do make mistakes. And had I known Daniel Bryan was going to take me seriously after what I said last My week, first mission I was said, to said, get 3,000 videos. Uh, I did it. Before New Year's. Before New Year's. Then my second mission was to get 100,000 views. My third mission is to get 1,000 subscribers. Come on, people. 1,000 subscribers. Because that's the only thing that's holding me back from getting paid. Hit them hard and hit them fast. Hit them so hard and so fast, they don't know what happened to them. I think a lot of people get. But these guys are pretty you know, they know what to do and they're professional. And logic tells me the one million subscribers but no views. 
So it don't matter if you got one million subscribers. That don't matter. Subscribers ain't making you the money. The views is what's making you the money. Yes, and that's what I got. I got the views. Yes. So I don't know how they're getting subscribers while getting the views. I guess subscribers are easier to get than views. I don't know. And yes, Sammy, Sammy, Kevin Owens no? have non-title victories over me. They do. But that, that doesn't mean they but, deserve a shot at the WWE Championship. Separately, let's do it. I'll fight both of them. I had YouTube boot camp. And they told me. Do it on SmackDown. I don't agree Go out there and record. Go out there and record. Y'all seen all the videos I did? Zoominator, check it out. The Zoominator, that's me. I'm a moped, trying to do wheelies and stuff. <laughs> I'm a moped. It goes 55 miles an hour. And all them trips, I made, I made the Beaver Dam. I went to Beaver Dam so many times that broke the throttle cable twice. The throttle cable, I broke it twice. Going back and forth to Beaver Dam from Box Lake. I'm not going to do this. I'm not going to point fingers. I'm not going to put myself in the middle of what Shane McMahon and Daniel Bryan are going through. I don't want to. I'm already in the middle of Sammy Zane, Kevin Owens. I don't know. That's from holding the throttle open. That's what's going to happen. All the time going back and forth. You know? I don't know. But still sitting there at Bill Warren's. Hopefully he'll get it done by spring. I can't allow those two idiots to take my championship from me. He told me that I might as well go ahead and take the insurance off of it because uh, it's going to be a while before he gets the fix. I'm like, why? Why is it going to be a while? I can be right, right there right now. It's 40 degrees off. Bill, come on, fix that. I can be taking my mobile to work. Ah. I can be taking my moped to work right now. It's 40 degrees out. Ain't no snow. Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for the WWE Champion. Now, wouldn't that give you some views, huh? Ah. In January, riding my moped to work. <laughs> or should we call you a crazy car? Tonight, AJ, the, uh, how about the regretful AJ Styles? Or the now that would give me more views, right? I'm all about the views. Yeah. Why am I getting views, you say? Why and how? Because I do crazy yeah. stuff. Yeah. I eat hot peppers. Did you all see the video? Me eating the Brandon Boyd ghost pepper challenge? Yeah. Check it out. I almost died. For y'all. Yeah. Tom come up to me at work. I did at work. He goes, how old are you? I go, 53. He goes, don't you think you would know better? He goes, why did you do this? Why? And that's sad. I did it for my fans of YouTube. Because I videotaped it. I should have videotaped the aftermath. But I could have gotten in trouble for doing that because, you know. Did on a 15 minute break. Shouldn't have did that. Should have. I should have waited until the half hour break so you guys could see the aftermath. But they never do show the aftermath. Y'all ever seen that? No. They stop recording right away, don't they? Yeah. Why? Because it shuts 
you die. It shuts down all your organs and everything. It literally puts you out. And I ate Brandon Boyd's ghost pepper challenge, 10 million scrolling hot. I mean, it literally shut me down. I mean, I couldn't breathe. I couldn't see. I was shaking. I was pulsating sweat like you wouldn't believe. <clears throat> I mean, my stomach was so cramped up. Uh, I could not even stand up. I was literally leaning on my table, thinking I was going to freaking die. I was ready to say, Bruce, you know, like this. Bruce, call, call 911. Oh, oh, man, but what will they do for me? What can they really do for you? They say that people that do eat them peppers, they're in the hospital for at least three weeks. Three weeks before they recover. Really? Three weeks? Oh, God, so they take it as a really, you know, this thing is, you know, people over-exaggerate. I get, well, like I said, please do not try to do what I do at home. Please. Whatever you see me doing, don't. Don't try it at home because I am not a normal person. A normal person would not try to do, well, if you do and something happens to you, one of those don't blame me. Here don't blame me, please. Right don't try to sue me. Don't try to blame me. Because I warned you guys from the beginning. Do not try to do any of my stunts. Do not try to repeat none of my stunts. Nothing. Don't try to do mo you know, willies with your moped or none of that. Don't. 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 Don't put salt in your beer with lime juice and, you know, don't shake up your... You know, your blood blood orange, don't shake it up before you drink it, you know. And don't try to eat raw eggs or, you know, through the shell because, you know, I did get uh, dredging skill, a.k.a. as Josh. I did get him to eat the raw egg, but he did it wrong. He cracked it open and put it in a glass. Wrong, Josh. Wrong. Wrong, Josh. Wrong. You're supposed to poke a little hole in one side, put your finger over it, turn it around, poke a hole in the other side, then suck it through the shell. Josh, you did it wrong. You really disappointed me. I hope you see this video, and I hope you realize and understand you did it wrong, Josh. You let me down. You didn't do my challenge. No. You, you, yeah, you might have ate a raw egg. So what? Big deal. But you didn't do it the way I asked you to do it. The way I did it. The Hungarian way. The way my father taught me. Put a hole in it. Turn around. Put another hole in it. Suck it through the shell. Josh. Suck it through the shell. That's a real man. Just right now, do not try to do what I'm doing right now. I almost choked to death right now. I dumped all that in my mouth. And I almost gasped for air. Yeah. And the first time you breathe in, You'll bring all those chips into your lungs and you can choke to death and die. Please, people, do not try to attempt any stunts that I do, all right? I am a highly trained professional. I've been doing this stuff for years. Do not try to do what I do, all right? Please. I almost choked to death just right now. My nose was plugged up. I couldn't breathe. And what I did was I shut my breathing system down, chilled out, and started lubricating my mouth right away. I get, I get off one layer of saliva 
I can probably do that cinnamon challenge, yes. I probably can. I I I I can produce a layer all the way around, a complete bubble inside my mouth. Of fluid. And then in that process, in the back of my throat, I take my tongue and I start shoving it down my throat right away. Start swallowing it right away. Because it's got liquid all around it. So it's like in a big bubble right now. Do it quick and fast without choking. I start breaking my mouth downward, pulling it upward, which will create an air pocket on top of my mouth. That's when I open up my top lip and I breathe in air. Do not try to do that. Please, please, I beg of you. Do not try to do what I do at home. Please. Please, do not try to do what I do at home. Okay. Okay. No. This time was... This time was... Um, it, it do half on. Huh. When y'all see me choking up in the morning like that, gasping and getting for air and stuff, well, man, how are you doing this? I'm, I'm actually bringing up with my plum parts of food that I inhaled. I'm telling y'all, I am not normal. Sure, I get chunks of food in my lungs all the time. Like when I'm talking to people and eating at the same time, bad mistake. Do not try that. Do not talk with your mouth open. Number one rule. Number one rule. Please, people, do not try to tempt any of my stunts. Please, I beg of you, please, do not attempt any of my stunts that I do at home. Please. I don't want to hear no stories that my son Johnny tried to do what you do and we warned him not to try it because, you know, I'm back. You know crazy Carl is crazy and they don't seem to understand that and they want to be just like you. Sure, you know, I can understand that. The last woman from Smackdown Live to announce that our metric, which See, I just, no I just spit it out through my lungs, a, a chunk of potato chip. Like that. That chunk just blew up when I breathed out. But, I see how kids react when they see me. They get excited. There he is, there he is, there he is. They, they say, you the man! You the man! And that's right. Remember, I'm the man. I'm the man. Okay? I'm an entertainer. You guys just watch me. That's it. Watch what I do. And please do not attempt to try any of my stunts at home. Please. Please. Just like when I do this, uh... Amazon cheese. Now, y'all see me do like this and shake it down my mouth like this, y'all. I completely fill my mouth up with this. Now, I can see somebody choking to death on that. And my niece station in Milwaukee would say, why don't you just spit it out? Even if you try, you that's when you will choke. When you try pushing on air, try spinning out with air, now you're going to be gasping and more. You're going to be gas, gasping and more trying to get air. And that's when you're going to start choking. Please. Please, people. I warn you. Please. Please. Do not attempt any of my stunts. See, watch. I take this beer. All right? Let me put some lemon juice in there. Shake it up. All right? 
Now the first thing I'm do is I'm, I'm gasping in the air. You know, I got big lungs. Okay, I got a 40, uh, what is it, 49 inch chest. I got a 49 inch chest, okay? Okay, I got a big chest. So I gas in the air, you know, before I would even try this stuff, okay? Gas in some air, so now I got air in me. Right, gas in the air. Wait for the salt to come down. I hope I don't choke because I'm talking. I'm waiting for the salt to fall down. Sometimes it might take a while. Sometimes it might give them a little bump, but that's cheating. I want this to go down naturally. And if it don't work, I would put a little more salt in it, which makes it more dangerous. See? Please do not try to do that. Please, I beg you, please, please, do not try to, I see I almost took the gun. I do this for entertainment, alright, entertainment people, I've been doing it for years, please, please, I recommend, do not try to attempt any of my stunts that you see me do, please, please, I beg you, do not attempt any of my stunts that you see me doing. Sure, it might look easy, might look like, yeah, yeah, he's talking a bunch of wind out of his ass, whatever. Trust me, it's not that easy. I am not a normal person. <laughs> Any normal person <laughs> will probably end up in the hospital dead a long time ago. But you can't kill the willing to live, you know? I cut my arm off with a chainsaw, people. I had a half a pint of blood inside of me. And you know what kept me alive? Talking. Talking. They all say, yeah, that's what kept me alive. I stayed awake. Now, the worst thing that happened is, you're, you're bleeding out. Don't go to sleep. You know, don't go to sleep. You go to sleep, you go into a coma, you go into a coma and you die. Because you can't control nothing when you're sleeping. You're out. That's it. Boom. You die. You need oxygen into your brain, people. You don't get oxygen into your brain if you're not talking. See? See? Did you hear that? You can't get oxygen into your brain if you're not talking. So me talking was putting oxygen into my brain, me talking, and I'm a talker, yeah, I am a talker. So, uh, I guess my next stunt could be uh, Cheese Whiz, Crackers, and that Smoke Pit Summer Sausage. I'll be right back. In beer. I'll be right back. That's going to be my dinner.
Pride has got all the potential in the world to be a big time, long term player here on SmackDown Live. Yeah, potential is one thing, but you gotta back it up. Right, back I feel really bad. I didn't do my dishes yet, and I'm thinking I need a knife, I need a knife, I need a knife. Duh! Duh! What's in this? Belt loop. Duh! Duh! Why did you buy this for if you're not gonna use it? If you don't want it, I'll take it. Well, can't stand that, Mike Nelson. Ooh! Duh. I'll take it. Yeah. I'll take it. I'll use it. That's how Mike Nelson does. He take anything free. Yeah, anything free. Something good, you know. A knife? Oh, yeah. He'll take it. He'll use it. Yeah. Duh. Is this rest for me? To since you're not gonna eat it, I might as well finish it, right? Okay, I'm gonna finish it, Mike. Just for you. I am gonna finish it. Just for you, Mike. Okay, clean the blade off. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Trust me, this knife is sharp. I never touched it with the sharpener or nothing because this thing is sharp. I gotta blow my nose. 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 I'm not turning to doing gas for air. Well, I'm showing. Crackers down my throat. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to start a new video. I'm going to stop this one. Because, you know, it's on 27 anyway, so it's going to be, you know, 10, whatever. This is going to be part one of part two.